Marking a departure from the colonial past, Prime Minister Narendra Modi will unveil a new naval ensign on 2nd September at the commissioning ceremony of India's first indigenous aircraft carrier, INS Vikrant in Kochi, Kerala. The Indian Navy will relinquish a colonial era flag, the cross of St. George and will adopt a new naval ensign, the flag its ships fly. The Prime Minister will dedicate the nation the new naval ensign, doing away the colonial past and befitting the rich Indian maritime heritage. Notably, as per a Navy official, the Indian Navy will get a new insignia without the St. George's Cross, which has been there on its flag ever since the British put on it before the pre-independence era. At present, the naval ensign has a red cross set on a white background with the national emblem placed at the intersection at the Indian flag in the top left quadrant. From 1950 to 2001, the Navy's ensign was the St. George's Cross on the white background with the national flag in the upper canton before it was changed in 2001. Between 2001 to 2004, the Indian Navy adopted an indigenous ensign that showed only the Indian flag and the Navy's crest bringing in the commonality with the flags of Indian Air Force and Indian Army that have the national flag and the respective services crest set on red and blue backgrounds respectively. In 2004, the Indian Navy returned to its pre-2001 ensign with the addition of the state emblem placed at the intersection of the cross. The next change in ensign came in 2014 when Satyamev Jayate were replaced under the national emblem at the center of the St. George's Cross. And that is here the Navy ensign currently stands since 2014. Notably, as per the Navy officials, the government of India is choosing from 10 different designs that have been given to them by the Naval Headquarters. These suggestions range from depicting 11 waves on the flag representing 11 different coastal states to showcase the different commands of the force. Prime Minister Narendra Modi will visit Karnataka and Kerala on 1st and 2nd September. Designed by Indian Navy's in-house warship design bureau and built by Cochin Shipyard Limited, a PSU under the Ministry of Ports, Shipping and Waterways, INS Vikrant has been built with the state-of-art automation features and it is the largest ship ever built in the maritime history of India. For more such content, please subscribe to PBNS.